do I leave or do I stay? Hey? and today I am going to be doing my first ever clothing haul. Um, let me take these off so you don't see my light. But today I'm going to be diving in to the clothes that I've bought. I have bought too many but we're going to try them all on. I've already got one set on. Um, some of them are casual wear, a lot of them are dresses. I will Hopefully remember to tell you where I got them all from. But please stay tuned, I'm not gonna bore you all with the details. I got them from multiple places and yeah, let's just dive into it. The first thing I'm showing off is this very comfortable long sleeve shirt. Um, I got it mostly for work because we don't have a uniform and it's very casual. So a long sleeve shirt, we're going into winter, I think it's a perfect fit, it's very comfy, I really like it, no complaints, yeah. Um, I've been wearing it for a while when I was procrastinating making these videos, so I can confidently say, ignore my phone, I can confidently say that this shirt is comfortable and I would love to live on it. These pants, however, are the second thing I want to show you, oh firstly I got this one from Big W. Go from Big W, it cost me like five bucks I think. So I always get my shirts, replace them every year, and I got a t-shirt over there, a black one, and it cost me $2.75, and I don't know, that sounds worth the price to me, but yeah, when I get sick of them, I become workout shirts, but yeah, so I'm pretty happy with it, it's comfy, it's loose, I really like it. These pants, on the other hand, which I got from Target. They cost me four dollars, two dollars. They cost me two dollars um, because end of season sale. Yeah, they cost me two bucks, and for that they have like an itchy tag, which I guess I can just remove. But when I walk, they like rise, and my thighs. I don't know. My thighs are a bit chunky for them, so they get a bit tight around my thighs. But otherwise, I'm in the comfy. I'm losing weight anyway, so it'll be comfier the more I. I wear them, though this is sort of as tight as they can go. I've tried to tie tighter before, but yeah, I don't know. Yeah, this is the next thing I got. I've never gotten myself a um, fancy bra before, like one that's like worth a bit from an actual bra place. I got myself fitted, got the bra, I got undies to match it. <laughs> yeah, I got undies to match, they've rolled a bit. Yeah, they do tend to roll a bit. They are my size, but they don't seem to sit where they're meant to. I'm not going to take my pants off because they get a bit um, sheer. But they're very pretty. Um, maybe if I lose a little bit of weight, they'll stop rolling. I think it's because I do have the fat line here that it makes them sag down. But yeah. This does have white straps. It comes with white straps, but I got clear straps because I had to wear it. I've already worn this bra. It is very comfortable. I wore it all day. Um, but it comes with white straps. I changed the straps because I had to wear a certain shirt with it, which is going to be what I'm about to change into. Sorry, I keep looking here. I should be looking here. I'm getting used to using the camera and not the viewfinder. Please have patience with me. I'm just petting my cat. She's over here. She's my little spectator. The next thing I have to try on is these pair of jeans. I really, really love them. I already have a black pair. I had to get myself this light wash pair. They're high rise skinny jeans. Apparently they're meant to lift the booty. I think they're doing a fantastic job. Um, yeah, I really like them. I've worn them, I wore these out with the top that I wore for this one. 
already, which is about to chuck it on. But yeah, these are the butt shaper jeans from Target. I got this bra from Bras and Things too, I never mentioned that earlier. But yeah. And this is the shirt I was talking about. I got it from H&M. I do really like it. Um, so this is why I needed the, the clear straps for because I can't trust. I don't. I find strapless bras very uncomfortable, and I can't just go without a bra. I'm not not with these girls here. So I, don't, I think it's cute. I really like this. My only issue is, my issue is that when I sit down, I get this sort of like halo of fat that tends to go around, but I don't know. I still think it's cute. I mean, I can wear it to work, and I don't really sit down at work, so it'll be fine then. Like, even when I just hunch over, you can see, sort of see it. But yeah, I think it's cute. It's stretchy. It's not see-through. I tried on the size smaller than this because this is a size large um, and it was like very stretched out, sort of like this, by boobs. But otherwise it fit me everywhere else. $5 t-shirt from Big W. This is like the black one I'm about to show you. This one's a bit looser fitting though. Um, another shirt that I bought for work. Um, yeah, not much to say on it, just as comfortable as the other one. It's good. So it's probably like the exact outfit I went to work actually. Do you appreciate how I didn't do my hair or any makeup today? I didn't want to distract you. <laughs> That'd be too beautiful. I lie, I thought this one was going to be a tighter fit. It's not, it's actually just the same, just as comfortable. No complaints. Exactly the same as the other one. This is just a different colour to the green one I wore before, the white first shirt that I wore. Um, it's pretty good. The only complaint is that it is a bit sheer. Even my white bra is coming through. I can see the lace in it. If I come up close, direct you down. I don't know if you can see, but you can see like my bra through it. See? Actually, a quick note. Um, this thing that I'm wearing isn't from this haul. I'm putting it on so you can see the details in the next shirt. But this is it. It does look better. It looks better as a black shirt in my opinion, but you can't see all the details on it. So I'm just going to leave it with the white shirt. Imagine. But it's not my favourite to be honest with you, but that's just my style. I tried it on earlier when my mum was around and she really really liked it. I had a black shirt on until then. It looks a lot better with the black shirt, I'm going to be honest with you. But, yeah. I don't know, it's not my favourite. I feel like it makes me look really broad. I mean, I have broad shoulders as it is. I don't really need that feature accentuated. I feel like it accentuates my, like, out here. It just makes me look a bit larger than I am, and I'm already pretty... I don't know, I already have somewhat weight on me. I don't really need help there. It's not my favourite. I probably wouldn't wear this one, to be honest. It's a little itchy, too. I got this one from Shein. This is the first one of a few that I got from Shein. Um, but yeah, it's not, it's not my favourite. Moving into the dresses. Um, I think it looks cute. It's not my style. I, don't, I, like, I normally like them a little bit more like warm fitting. But it's cute. I'll still wear, definitely wear this one. Probably when I'm out of all the others. But maybe if I could like just find a belt for it to cinch it a bit. I don't know, I just, I like accentuating my waist, I feel like it makes me look a bit leaner. But, it's definitely uh, like a flowy, comfortable sort of dress. Actually, the material's really comfortable in this one. Like, I feel like, like you can bunch the shoulders up, and then I fall down, they won't bother you. Like, it's a really soft material. I thought, I didn't, I've heard a lot of reviews on Shein and I wasn't sure myself because I know that they're a cheaper company. I was expecting like, not the best quality material, but this is like really soft and I really, really like it. Like I don't, it's not my favourite, my next one's my favourite. I tried it on, I tried it on 
and let me tell you it was let me just put it on for you look i have to gonna have to put the arms up a bit so i can use my hands but otherwise isn't this the cutest dress ever it's so flowy it's soft it's got a pretend little tie up but it's actually elasticated here it's got a cute little skirt i really like the color i think it suits me quite well and then i think if there's other color variations of this one i am definitely diving back in to get some more because i really like it i love like the bell the bell sleeves i've never been a big fan of them but knowing that i can hike them up and have my hands free and have this little swooshy motion makes me very happy i think this is like my new favorite dress isn't this cute okay i got this one in the sales section at h&m i don't remember how much it cost me but it was at least 30 percent off at least and i am in love with it okay, this is a dress i'm definitely gonna wear, wear to work no questions asked my battery's about to die so we're gonna move on to the next dress but it's super soft super comfy i love it let's get going to the next thing I should mention that these are not fake buttons. They actually work. The only downfall is that there's no pockets. There's no pockets in any of these dresses, which is a crime. But anyway, this is the final dress I got. I got this one also from H&M. I did not get this one special. I think it's really cute. I think it's like classy, nice. I really like it. I like hanging at the front because I feel like this, because it draws in, it brings my waist in. I tried hanging at the back and I don't like it as much. It's not the softest material, but it's not scratchy either. I really like it. These cute, um, I've been wearing it with like a necklace and like hair down. Would be really, really lovely. Wearing it with some tights, heels, or flats. I don't know, I really like it. It's like business chic, but also not. It's heading into the winter, so I figured a nice little cardi would do me good. It's Australia, so it doesn't get that cold. I don't really need to be that concerned about finding the warmest jumper around. Do I think that this jumper suits this dress? No. Do I think this jumper's cute? I'm debating it. I wonder if these buttons are weird. Like, the hemming's been done weird. It's, like, really thick. I'll show you what I mean. Fifi is trying to get in the view. I'm sorry, you're very unhappy. I mean. What I was talking about with like the weird hemming. It's like, see how like thick it is? It like rides up a bit. I don't know. I'll probably still wear it, but it's not my favorite. I'm too lazy to chuck, take off this dress and put on a shirt. But my last thing is these. I hope you enjoy that Fifi's in shot. Um, these are some bracky dacks, some sweats, some comfy pajama pants from Bonds. Love the waistband. That's the entire reason I bought them. And they're like super soft. They made them a really comfy material. I absolutely love them. They also brighten my ass quite a bit. Um, <laughs> But yeah, really cute. I love them. I do love them. Hi. I don't know if that was in focus. Editing me will find out. Um, if it wasn't, I will reshoot it again, which you can tell I am stoked for. Um, Fifi wants to leave the room, which I'm not going to let her do because the only reason she wants to leave the room is because she thinks it's night time. She thinks it's bedtime. It is night time, so it is also bedtime. So I'm going to change into my pajamas. I'm already halfway there. Got the pants on. Just got to put a shirt on, which I might just use one of the shirts I showed earlier. And then we're going to snuggle ourselves in a bed. We're going to get a good book and we're going to go to sleep. So I hope you have a wonderful day or night or whatever. And I will hopefully see you next time. Well, I won't see you, but hopefully you'll see me next time. You know? Bye!